Yo, what is good everybody? It's your boy Boone, Connect you guys with a brand new video. Um, my apologies you guys for not uploading for the last two days. I've just been kind of busy dealing with like shipping um, and other complications with my sale I had over the weekend on my website, see how select, but I'm not really trying to get into that or anything. I'm just trying to explain to you guys why I haven't uploaded in the last two days. I hate being inactive. It actually bothers me like so, so much when I don't upload. My apologies, but we're gonna get right back to the action on my channel now with a brand new video series that I wanted to introduce to you guys. Um, I've been saying this for the last couple weeks that now that Supreme's ending, I'm gonna be doing a lot of different types of videos on my channel um, one of the types of videos I want to do is just kind of rating people's outfits I've obviously done videos like that before where I rated your guys outfits I've rated my subscribers brands before now I'm gonna be rating celebrities slash rappers um, today we're gonna be starting it off with Playboy Cardi Cash Cardi himself I didn't um, one of my favorite rappers, honestly, like especially before he started like really blowing up, before he dropped his album, I was a humongous Cardi fan. Um, Cardi's really well known for wearing tons of Supreme, but now he gets a lot more into the designer just because my boy can afford it. So in a second, we're just going to dive into some outfit pictures I found of him online that I have saved on my phone. And I'm just going to kind of rate them, give my opinion of them, like how I think he dresses. At the end, I'll give him a final rating. If you guys want to see me do these videos with any other rappers, comment them down below. Um, I do have a list of rappers kind of in my head of like who I'm gonna do next but I'm sure some of you guys have some great ideas as well there's so many rappers and like celebrities to cover so um, I think it'll be a cool little video idea drop a like if you guys enjoy this video series and want more um, and yeah let's just start jumping into it I don't want to do too long of an intro so I'm gonna do my best to point out any pictures that are new Cardi or old Cardi you can really just tell based on his dreads how long they are so this is kind of like in between this is him and the young homie John Ross honestly I don't know a ton about the backstory with John Ross however I do know he's very incorporated in the fashion world especially with like Ian Connor and stuff like that. Hey, this is my child. His okay. name is John Wilkes Booth. He killed Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> I believe he designs clothes. I'm not positive though, but um, here's John Ross and Playboy Cardi, and I love this outfit. So my man's Cardi is strapped up with the box logo, of course. This man wears so many box logos. Um, I believe that's a navy on gray. I could be wrong about the box logo color. Um, then he has the Kappa pants, of course. I actually have those exact same Kappa pants in that navy colorway. And then I believe those are Nike Dunks, SB Dunks. I could be incorrect. They look like they're like some weird quilted pattern. I actually really like those shoes. And this outfit for me just like absolutely drip. Cardi used to almost always have Supreme on. This is not like a super recent photo. You can tell because he doesn't have his stuff like braided up. Started braiding his hair a lot more. Um, but I actually love this outfit a lot. It's super wearable. This is definitely something I would wear. Um, Cardi wears like a lot of just really basic outfits, especially early on. Um, it seemed like he didn't do a lot of layering. Maybe that's because he's from Atlanta where it's like pretty hot. But I've noticed in a lot of his older pictures, he never really has a lot of layering going on. Just very basic. This is a super clean outfit though. There's not a lot to say about it. Um, the color coordination is on point. Those shoes are interesting. I like the quilted look to them. I love how he's incorporating the vintage Kappa look with some Supreme. That's like one of the things Cardi does I love about him so much. Um, he always is incorporating Supreme with some other like dope streetwear items. Um, so let's move on to the next photo. So now as you guys can probably tell, this is a very recent Cardi picture. Um, like I was saying, he's got his hair braided up and stuff now, trying to look like Amigo or something. Um, he's got the wrap jumper on, which is crazy hard. I love that wrap piece. And I actually have not really seen a lot of people wear the blue colorway. You usually see the cream which I kind of prefer. Um, however, I do love that tone of blue. Um, I don't know what those jeans are or the shoes, so you guys can correct me. Um, those look like those could be some like Yeezy boots, but I'm probably not right. Honestly, in this video, there might be a couple times where I don't know what a certain item is. If you guys want to fill me in, just let me know in the comments. My apologies, you guys. I'm not like a fashion guru, but um, for me, this outfit, like I love the top half. I think if you just cut off the top half, this shit bangs super hard. My issue with it is I don't like these light wash jeans with the top part. It just looks very offsetting. On top of that, I think the black boots with the wash jeans just looks very strange. Um, I do think the black in like the boots really does coordinate well with the New York. Uh, I just wish he had done like an all black. I think if the pants were just black, this would have gone way harder. Um, however, I do love the top half. He kills it, especially the accessories, bro. Like my man is dripping with all the chains. You cannot look bad when you have that many chains around your neck. Um, however, I would say like this outfit's nowhere near as good as that last outfit in my opinion, but let's keep going. So this is actually one of my favorite outfits that I found of Cardi. Um, the reason I love this so much is the layering is just like so bizarre like this is an outfit I would never ever like think to put on I could not wear a vest like that I don't think I don't think I'd be able to rock it like he does um he's got like the little bandana around his neck Cardi actually does that a lot putting bandanas around his neck and I think it's a really cool look um it's definitely like very him and I respect him for kind of making his own fashion lane I love the shoes I've seen those before that have like this drawn on look to them um let me know the actual name of those shoes in the comments I can't remember the name of them right now um however they're super super fire I believe they might be some v loan 
orange shoes, but I don't want to say it and be wrong. Um, I think this actual outfit though drips. It looks like that's like a number nine shirt just because it's got Mickey Mouse on it. That's why I'm guessing it's number nine. And I know he rocks a lot of number nine. I love those pants though. I think the pants are crazy hard. Uh, I actually just love this outfit so much and the way that he's got like the jacket kind of draping down, it almost looks like he's trying to get this picture on purpose, even though it does look like a paparazzi photo. No Supreme in this photo. This is definitely like a more recent picture. Um, I love this outfit though. I think the colors actually match really well. Um, I think that the like camo with the black vest is a nice little contrasting touch with all the light colors he has going on. And then the bandana just gives it that little Cardi sauce. Um, but this is a crazy hard fit. My favorite probably we've looked at so far. So now we're going to go back to an older Cardi flick. And this one is a very, very basic outfit. Um, like I was saying, Cardi's older outfits seem to be very basic. I see him wear a lot of Nikes or Jordans um, just with Supreme items. In this picture, we have a little Stone Island quarter zip. Um, I love Supreme Stone Island collabs, but this jacket and this colorway is a little rough in my opinion, just because I think the colors are very, very difficult to match with other items. Um, they're very glaring colors that you wouldn't usually see together. I'm actually a little surprised that he wore this half zip with some like super stonewashed light jeans. I would have worn this outfit with super dark jeans. However, I think he actually rocks it. With this outfit, it looks like he's rocking some fours that have little like tones of blue in them. Um, I just put this one in here because I think it's crazy he was able to actually make this like super loud Stone Island piece look very, very subtle. And just the whole outfit I think actually goes together really well. I'm telling you guys, Playboy Cardi wore so much Supreme back in the day. Like I actually love it. Um, it makes me super happy. Like you don't really see any rapper putting on for Supreme as much as Playboy Cardi has. Well actually maybe Tyler the Creator, but not even him I don't think. Playboy Cardi straight up always was caught wearing Supreme back in the day. For this next picture we have another older Playboy Cardi outfit. Um, in this outfit, my man's got the CDG Supreme work jacket. It's from like 2015 I want to say. Um, some jeans. Uh, I don't know what that hoodie is and I don't know what the jeans are. And then he's got the Jordan 1s. I absolutely love this outfit. Um, I love the like color coordination between the jacket and the shoes. The blue jean color he chose I actually like a lot. I think it gives a little more color to the outfit. He could have just gone with some black jeans, but then he would just had a lot of blacks and greens and reds in this. Um, he gave it a little offsetting color with the jeans. So I actually love this fit a lot. And I feel like I've been like sounding like I'm really dick riding Cardi so far in this video, but I really do like the way Playboy Cardi dresses. Probably like out of every rapper, he's in my top three, top five best dressed rappers. So now we're gonna go to a super ignorant photo. Um, in this picture, Cardi's got the Supreme uh, Rose Sherpa reversible jacket that dropped in like 2016, 2017. I can't remember the exact year. Super hard Supreme jacket though. I wish I had grabbed one of these when they originally released. With that, he has the clout goggles, a little shoulder bag. I'm not sure what the brand is. Um, he's got some black jeans that are a little washed, a little vintage looking. And then he's got the green Nikes on his feet. Um, honestly, for me, this is probably one of my least favorite outfits, if not my least favorite in this video. This just looks like one of those classic LA rapper flexes, like really doing the most to wear some super out there loud outfit. The green on his shoes looks more like a leprechaun green, while the green on his jacket's more like an olive earthy green. So I just really hate that. I don't like that he's got like the black on black on black with the white shoes. I think that looks bad. He should've just gone all black. Um, this outfit out of everything so far is by far his worst. This is a very clowned outfit to me, but it just looks like a rapper flex pick. Like it looks like he's just doing the most to look like some SoundCloud rapper. So we're gonna end off this video with one last outfit. This is probably my favorite outfit in the entire video. This is definitely a more recent Cardi outfit yet again. Um, I'm not quite sure what this jacket is. Please do let me know because I absolutely love it. The color of it looks great. It looks like there's little like navy hints on it. Um, like all the pockets and stuff all over it are insane. Like this jacket hits super hard. Um, under that it looks like he has the vintage Mickey Mouse shirt. Playboy Cardi for whatever reason seems to wear a lot of Mickey Mouse stuff. Usually it's number nine, but in this it's actually looking like a vintage piece, which is awesome. I'm loving that he's mixing the designer with the vintage. Um, I love this outfit because it has such an old school classic look. On his feet, he's got the Rick Owens that look a lot like Converse. Um, I absolutely love these Ricks. They are super, super expensive. You guys don't know Rick Owens. It is like one of the top tiers of fashion in terms of just like brands and it is expensive, but so, so fire. Um, I actually went to the Rick Owens store while I was in Soho. That was super crazy. Um, but this is such a sick outfit because it looks like an old school greaser look. Um, while he's also rocking a ton of designer, but also has some vintage on. This is an insane outfit. I absolutely love it. I think the only thing that might've made it better is if he put a little red bandana around for that like vintage Cardi look. Um, I think that would've helped with the vintage aesthetic, giving a little more red color, like a little more than just the basics black and whites we're seeing in this picture. Um, but this is my favorite outfit in this whole video. I think he kills it with this one. Um, everything just looks so well fitting together. I love Playboy Cardi style a lot. I think it's very like wearable, it's very practical. You see some rappers out here that just have like the loudest, most obnoxious stuff on. Uh, but my dude Cardi like really seems to keep it basic, keeps it clean. My favorite Cardi is definitely back in the day, old school Cardi, just because his 
outfits look so similar to a lot of stuff I'd wear. Um, I'd give Playboy Cardi a 9 out of 10 in terms of the way he dresses. Good job! I actually love it a lot. Like I said, it's very wearable to me. I don't think he tries to wear super out there loud pieces. Let me know what you guys thought of this video. Drop a like if you want to see more videos of this series of me just rating um, rappers and celebrities outfits. I'm super excited to start making more videos like this and believe me, I have way more ideas of videos I'm going to be doing now that Supreme's coming to an end. Um, you guys will be seeing the week, uh, what is it, 20 drop list from me tomorrow, I promise. Also, I did forget to mention I did not go for Palace this morning. Screw that. I already knew I was not going to get anything. I did have a homie try to run some bots for me. Did not work, unfortunately, but what are you going to do? I never have success with bots, so I hope you all enjoyed the video. It's been your boy Boone. I'm out. Peace.